Hi guys, welcome to this session in Microsoft Project. In this module, I want to show you how you can allocate resources and also find out who is available, how many hours as a particular resource got left. So what I've got on the screen is a very small project plan and on the resource sheet down the bottom right here, I've got four work resources. They're all on £10 an hour. Now if I come back to the Gantt chart, and click on the first task called teams and let's say I want to allocate a person to this task which is just a one-day task if I go to assign resources at the moment all the available resources are there but we've got here is available to work now if I tick that and push this up to eight hours they're all still available now if I start moving this past eight hours to nine hours None of those are available to do nine hours in that one day because of their calendar, their work times, only eight hours a day. That's what it's set to. So you can use this to see who's available. So I can pick any of these. So I'll assign Anne to this one. So she's on this task. Now, this task here is a four day task and they're all available for eight hours. But if I put this up to 32 hours, for example, see what happens. So they're all available for 32 hours. Anne's not available because these are all going on at the same time. Now, if I put this up to 40 hours, 40 hours. Let's see. As soon as you do that, none of them are available for 40 hours. So 30 hours, 32 hours is OK. You can pick any one of these 32 hours. So I'll assign Ben. Now the next task down is a five day task. So these are the people that are available to do 32 hours. Let's have a look at doing 40 hours for this one. So Bill and Bob are available for 40 hours work. So I'll assign Bob. And that's what you can use. You don't have to use this. You can take that off and all the resources will be displayed. You can filter resources from this drop down. This will give you options similar to the filter on the top there but it's quite a useful little tool to see who's available in terms of hours to carry out work on a particular task so that's all I want to talk about in this little video how you can assign resources and also identify which resource still has availability so thank you for your time and I'll catch you in the next one